Good day everyone. Welcome back to my Unreal Engine third person shooter series. And today I'm going to implement gun recoil like this. And as you can see here, when I start shooting, the hit point goes up. This is uh, what I'm simulating is the recoil effect of the gun and yeah that's what I'm going to cover today and this episode is sponsored by these generous patrons we thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me right so at the moment when I play the game and short you can see my gun is moving but the bullet is uh, hitting the same location like that so let's fix that because I need some kind of a scattering some kind of a spreading of the hit location to represent the recoil effect Right, so I'll open the gun blueprint and yeah, this is the fire event and yeah, and here I add the recoil to the parent actor, that means the character who's holding this gun, like this. Right, so to add some change to the place where the bullet is being hit, what I have to do is change in this target location. Right, uh, first let me clean this up a little bit. Because otherwise it, this will become too messy.
well I could do this uh, off the screen without recording but I don't want to do that till death because mm, because if you don't see what I'm doing then in the next episode you will have problems so that's why I am to I want to do this here in the recording And I hope you are okay with that. Why do we have two exits here? I think one would be enough. Yeah. Let's put this branch also inside. That way it's more clear. Okay now, mm, no. right now this is where I need to do that uh, recoil, reflecting recoil change, a recoil in the target location. So as I said for that I have to add some kind of offset to the target here. Right first uh, let's try some random values. I'll add Well, let me put this inside. No. Okay, random float in range. I'll do something between minus 30 to plus 30 right and see what happens all right mm. well I guess I'm getting some change let's go shoot at a wall so we can clearly see that yeah maybe here okay yeah I think it's working but uh, it would be better because uh, this uh, usually what happens is when we keep shooting the hit point goes up but here it's not like that so how can I fix that uh, right we can actually add some rotation movement not movement uh, rotation input to may move our cursor up 
so yeah I can do it here when I add recoil to the character yeah let's go to character and where do I add recoil okay here we can add not Rio pitch at controller pitch input first uh, let me quickly check where uh, the way I have implemented the mouse input I think I haven't done it here I have done it play for the player Like this okay well I don't think there would be any harm by doing it here well let's just add one here and see what happens oh uh, well not one if I add one it would be looking down I think I should add minus one Okay, let's see. Right, we get the effect. But if I keep shooting, I will eventually I will be looking at up without any control. So that's not good so we need to control this well uh, let's try first uh, reducing this a little bit instead of one let's try something like point one and see if it is good That's better. Right, so let's change this method a little bit. Add recoil here. I'll add uh, instead of recoil rotation, I'll change this to gun rotation. Uh, no, I'll keep it same. I'll add a new variable that should be uh, yeah a float would be enough because usually gun moves up pitch input right and okay now we have the pitch input here I'll directly connect it like this and compile and in the BP gun now I have this pitch input so this one I don't think I need it anymore Right. So here I'll promote this one to a variable. Let's call it recoil. Pitch input. Well I need two variables put max so 
so the max input I'll keep it as uh, one and yeah this is what I'm going to do add the recoil pitch input Mm, both variables should have the same amount at first and then set recoil pitch input with a half of it and set And when I'm done firing, I'll again set recoil pitch input with the recoil pitch input max. And let's see how it works now. should be minus values not plus values Uh, let's make it better yeah maybe instead of two let's try multiply it by point seven think the recoil is too much I'll make it 0.8 and set this one instead of 2 let's set them to 1 fine-tune it to get uh, any gun simulation you want any recoil simulation you need and if you like to support my work you can get the membership of my patreon club link would be in the description below and thanks for watching see you in the next episode goodbye also you can download the source code or the project files of this uh, project in the Patreon page and goodbye